What up dudes? This video is simply a file dump. I've taken all the files on my hard drive and dumped them in here. This was all shot right before I went on my hike across England, so if it's a bit dated, that's why. It was meant to go out before the hike, but I just didn't end up doing it because there's too much going on. This is also filmed during a month-long weed edible binge. So if my speech is a little off, just know that's why. I just had to put that disclaimer in here because I don't usually speak this way, and uh, I apologize for my incoherence. Anyway, I'm sober now, and this is why you're seeing the footage. This is now the last video before the hike video, which is going on the main channel, and all the behind the scenes will go on this channel. I'm very excited to post that, but this had to come out first, so enjoy it for what it is. I also wanted to say that I'm moving house in December. I'm moving to Spain. If everything goes the way it's supposed to, I'll be moving to Spain and getting away from winter. You guys know, if you've been watching the channel for a while, I struggle with seasonal affective disorder. Uh, mushrooms have treated it really well, but I prefer to not have to use them. I'd rather just get away from the cause. So I'm gonna be chasing the sun, getting away from winter here. But I need to do it. I can't do it to my mental health again. Last year I spent in Germany and it was tough. So I need to get somewhere sunny. And the way I'm raising funds is I'm selling some jewelry that I made this past two weeks. Uh, that's why I've been kind of MIA, I've been just making jewelry. It's all up on my website. Go to vithodiet.com. I wanted to put that in here before the video starts. I'm not gonna try and sell you it forever. Just, yeah, if you wanna carry a piece of my energy around with you. So I'm selling a few of these. I got some amethyst necklaces and some amethyst earrings on the store. Now, if there's anything else you wanna see me sell, just leave it in the comments. I'll, I'll buy some and I'll make it. Yeah, thanks for supporting. I already announced this earlier on Instagram, so a bunch of people have already bought some. If you are one of those people, I love you. Thank you so much. You are helping me move to a better place. And I really appreciate it. I, you know I can't stay in Wales forever. All right, all right, all right, all right. On with the video. Enjoy the file dump. See you guys in the past. <laughs> it feels good to be doing land achievements again. It feels good to be back, it really does. Happy to be alive. Yeah, I am cooking today, absolutely cooking. This is the hottest day I've experienced here in the UK so far. London's been getting 90 degrees, or 95 degrees this week. That's so nuts, why am I not down there? Why am I up here <laughs> missing it? I'm still not driving yet. I've been waiting for a big chunk of money to come in, which hasn't come in while I was away. So now I've got to chase it once I get that. Ow. I'm going to get the car and then I'm driving to Sea Scale. I'm doing a hike across England. That's where all my mental focus is right now. But I've still got this obstacle of editing all the ocean videos. <sighs> I want to kind of get the story out about the ocean stuff the best way I can. Maybe do a highlighting video for my main channel. I've got some big ideas for the main channel, guys. I know I've been slow as heck at doing anything over there. And that's just because I need an editor. If I had an editor, I could do everything that I want to do with both channels. At the moment, it's just me. That's why I'm just running the second channel full time. Uh, I'm kind of putting the main channel back in my mind. Because I'm also trying to stay healthy, enjoy all the sunlight, and um, hurry, hurry things up. I've got about a week, seven days, to get all these videos done. And then I'm going on this hike. And there's a lot of people waiting for me because I, it was my stupid, crazy idea. And a bunch of people want to come along with me. Walking down this mountain, you see that patch of water right there? That's where we're going, baby. Belle Delphine called these the Welsh Himalayas. I probably shouldn't put that in there. <laughs> Running down the mountain is like the best part of the whole thing. Nature's carpet. Um, 
mouth is so dry. I want to get a group together and camp this spot. It's so perfect. There's some old ruins all the way around. Perfect shelter for camping. You got this lake. So immediately the ground starts getting wetter. It's more absorbent and it feels nicer on the feet. Uh, up there it's quite dry obviously because it's on top of the mountain. There's a lot of shrubbery. But yeah, this is like wet grass. It cleans my feet really good. And now to swim in there with all the frogs and my dog. Yeah, buddy. It's because his fur is black, he gets very hot in the sun. It wasn't very fair of me to leave him sitting at the top of the mountain for an hour before bringing him for a bath. But now he has bathed again. Bathed, bathed, bageled, bageled. I want a bagel. Guys, I'm moving my setup from here, this little spot with this view, going to the other side, and I'm doing it all over there. But it's so nice, I need to remember what it looks like before I just get out of here. Cute little setup. Dudes, I'm back to daily vlogging. I don't know what to do with my hair today. I feel like it just looks silly, whatever I do. So I'm just gonna let it all down. <sighs> what do you guys think of the uh, color change? Basically, my 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 thinking is, whenever I let my roots grow out, I bleach them, obviously, and then they're blonde, and then I dye them blue, and they stay in blue. So what I've been doing lately, the past year or so, is dyeing my roots green because then the blonde doesn't stain and I can dye that blonde any colour I want in the future. So if I grow it all out, or leave it blonde, if I grow it all out and just keep bleaching the roots and then the blue that's currently here will disappear and then the green will eventually make it all blonde. So when the green washes away, it goes back to blonde instead of blue. Because blue just stains your dreads or any, any hair that will stain it. Stain it blue forever, that's why I'm always blue. This might work better on the green screen, so if I want to make my hair into like a dolphin, I can do that. Uh, we need to get the, the green morph suit out. I'm just so distracted because I'm going hiking in a couple, a couple days. Uh, that's basically what I want to talk about, is that I'm going hiking in a couple days. This is my first official Magic Mushies Discord meetup. We are hiking for the first time, we're doing something, we're actually getting out there. Uh, it's a long walk, it's like 140 miles. I've never done anything that long in one go, so it's a challenge for me also. And yeah, with a bunch of strangers. So it's gonna be fun content, but, but also like I, I've been planning it and, and make sure everything's going right, make sure everybody knows what to bring and where to meet. And <laughs> this is the warmest day we've had in a while. Decided to do the hike this week because I knew there was a heat wave coming in from the Azores. Now that I've done all the sailing, I've been doing loads of weather kind of just watching, waiting for weather windows to do things. Today would have been a good day to sail, actually. This is earlier than I was expecting. I, I, I thought I predicted the fourth. If the heat was gonna come in, but it feels like it's already coming now. Anyway, flip, I'm cooked. All right, so if you haven't seen yesterday's video, I basically showed you what I take hiking. What's in my backpack? What, are, what am I bringing on this trip? And if you wanna go and critique it, tell me what I should bring and what I shouldn't bring, how I can maybe trim the fat a little bit because it's quite heavy. At the moment, my camera's not even inside the bag. So at, at all times, I'm gonna have something out of the bag. It feels good to be driving again. I haven't really done any adventures in it yet but it feels good to just like have that stability. Just carrying around a car key gives you a lot of power. Like you can go places further than your feet will take you. Okay, I stopped driving because I originally wanted 
it was for ecological reasons, I guess. I wanted to not drive until I could afford a Tesla. And I realized that even the second-hand Tesla is going to take a few more years before it's affordable for me. <laughs> so I'm back to petrol. And my Australian friend doesn't need this car, it's hers. She doesn't need it. So while she's in Australia, she let me use it, which is great. And it's an automatic. So just, just brilliant. It's so much nicer than my last car. And it is also a Nissan, so we're keeping the micro Nissan. We're keeping Nissan in the in the. I'm good. Right. I stopped here anyway. I'm on a walk with Jazz. Stopped here to point out this. This makes me happy. This is really, really old, old uh, ivy that is trying to kill this tree, and it has finally been defeated by an, a chainsaw. <laughs> I've done this to a bunch of the trees to get the ivy off because they are. They're just suffocating the woods here. I don't know if they're like a. I don't know if, if, they're an, if they're an outside species that's come to destroy all our, all our trees, but it's awful and, it, and I hate it. I know it's good for bugs during winter and birds during winter, but there's so much of it. I don't know, I wanna save some of these trees. So I didn't do that, but somebody else did it and I'm happy. Let me know in the comments if you think ivy is bad or good, because I've had this long debate on Instagram about whether it is actually killing trees or not. But from what I've observed, yes, it kills trees. Yeah, shout out whoever did that. Anyway, we go for a stroll. I wanted to talk a bit a bit more about kind of how I'm feeling about meeting a bunch of people again. So this is my first kind of YouTube Discord meetup I've done in so many years. Uh, I used to do these publicly in a park in London. We would pick a random park and just meet up there. That's That was it. There was no planning ahead of that. We were just like, all right, let's go there on a Saturday. Let's hang out. And yeah, I did so much of that. So much networking back in 2012, 2013 and 2014 that I miss it. I miss that kind of social boost, just being able to talk to hundreds of people in a day. Uh, I haven't been getting any of that. I talk to my direct family, maybe one visitor. I don't talk to many people here. Now that I've got the car, now I've got the car again, I can go anywhere, man. Maybe do some like subscribers pay my petrol and I just drive to wherever they ask me to drive. That could be fun. If someone was crazy enough and just donated 200 bucks to go to Africa, I'd, I'd have to do it. There's plenty, there's so many opportunities now, we've got so much stuff we can do. <sighs> Sorry Joss, I'm, I'm talking to myself again buddy. But it's quite easy, if you had a hand you could do that yourself. Oh good though, that's why I'm here. Personally I'm mostly doing this hike because I want a, I'm trying to force myself to do an internet detox, I want to get off my phone. I tried to when I went sailing but because I had signal the whole time I was in charge of navigation and I had to be on my phone all the time and there was not much going on in the boat, so I was on my phone all the time. So yeah, I need, I need a phone detox. I am sponging up everyone's emotions at the moment. Like, it's Virgo season. I know that has nothing to do with how I'm feeling right now, but uh, it's my season to shine. I've noticed that all the people that I text regularly, all my friends, and also people I don't know that well, people I just talk to a lot, they are all having like a really hard time, and, it, and they're sharing it all with me. And oftentimes, oh, I'm, I'm an empath, so, I sponge everything up. I am SpongeBob SquarePants. And I need to cut myself off from all of that. I can't be there to help everyone all the time. I have to help myself first before I can help anyone else. If you come to me with the problems, I don't mean to disappoint, but I must leave. <laughs> I must exit the room. The third eye has left the chat. So yeah, when we get back, I'll do the full green screen suit with the green hair, the dog GoPro mount. It's gonna be hilarious. I'm so excited to, to meme this channel up a bit. Right, so when I get back from this hike, I'm going to be organising the next one. And I'll just tell you guys what it is now. We are doing Ben Nevis in Scotland. Scotland, I believe. I don't know where it is actually, but Ben Nevis. We're doing Ben Nevis. Uh, if you want to come hike it, make sure you're 18 plus. You know, I'm not responsible for your death. Have a bit of a hiking experience, I guess. I don't know. If you feel like doing a mountain, come along. The way we organise these is on Discord. So join the Magic Mushies Discord. The link is down below. It'll be the first line in the description. It says Discord. Click it. Download the Discord app. You can chat with all of us. Everybody that's in the comments here is on the Discord. So if you're not on the Discord yet, join us. That's how we organize these things. So yeah, first Magic Mushies Gathering happening soon. It's like Magic the Gathering, but it's Magic Mushies Gathering. <laughs> I didn't name it, you guys named it. I'm running with it. We also have a Reddit. What should we do with the Reddit? We've made a V3D Reddit. I have no idea what to do with it. Does anybody want to mod it? I don't know what to do with the Reddit. Post on it, post anything you want on it, I suppose, and then I will look at your stuff and rate your stuff. A weird mood. I need people to talk to. I'm s I've got such cabin fever and kind of missing socialising. 
It's strange. Usually I get my, my internet detox during festival season, season but they cancelled it all. So I've just been online every day. <laughs> the first of all problems. But it's an addiction and I need to remove myself so I can focus on me and not whatever's going on on my phone. How are you guys today? <laughs> uh, if, you, if you say anything in the comments, I will respond to it. Even if this is three months in the future, leave a comment, I will respond to it. I will check this video every day. How are you? That is the question. How are you? Get as in-depth as you like. Remember, it's not instant response, so you must leave long comments so I can leave long response. Thank you very much, please. I want to read some novels down there. Even if you just want to make something up, I will read it and respond to it. How are you doing today? Alright, yeah, we're going to continue this walk, huh? Yes. So the way things work around here. I live in farmland and if the farmer needs the field I can't use it. I'm really limited by where he puts his livestock, his animals. And luckily we found a free field today. So this is where we hang out. Walking up hills and talking doesn't work. Basically I have to watch him, what he does. He's driving around, moving his cows and his sheep around, his quad and his tractor. I have to watch him kind of predict where he's putting them or where they're not going to be and then I can go hang out in those fields. Anyway, this field is not too bad. So I've really been thinking, the world needs magic mushrooms right now. What a better chance to decriminalize everything. Like the world needs so much healing and so many people are not dealing with issues that mushrooms will bring out. The world really needs magic mushrooms right now. The world needs to change laws. So this is what I'm driving now. It's uh, still pretty small, but it's, it's almost as well. It's so much better than the last one. Uh, and yeah, I mean it's only temporary, but it's fun. I tried editing and cooking at the same time. It didn't really work out. Now I'm watching Duncan Trussell on uh, Joe Rogan Bobby's podcast. Yeah. 